this is Christina from Sweet Pea Birth. It's great to be back with you after our awesome vlog series we did with uh, Arizona Breastfeeding Center and the Milk Spot for our breastfeeding month in August. So make sure you check the link down in the comments for links to all those videos um, that we did in August. Now we're back in September and we're going to be talking about uh, how to prepare your body for the winter. Now, super important when you're pregnant to be sure to take care of yourself because your body is already lowering its immunity so that you can be pregnant and it doesn't reject the baby as an alien or foreign object. So two really important things that we talked about earlier in the year when we did our nutrition series. Number one, make sure you're getting lots of vitamin C. And it's, we had this question in class last week. It's not about taking a vitamin C pill because that's a chemical that's been, you know, there's some processing done. Your body's looking for something that's immediately, what the fancy word we use is bioavailable. Your body wants something that it can put straight into the system, the body recognizes it as, recognizes it as food, and then it's distributed into the body. So your vitamin C foods, again, I'm going to put a link to the blog post. I have an image there that was created by Dietitians Online that has 50 different vitamin C foods. It's not just about the citrus. So make sure you find something that has vitamin C. Same sign language, orange juice. You know, orange juice has a lot of sugar in it, so maybe just have an orange or grapefruit. And we're coming into Arizona's winter season when we have all these wonderful citrus fruits available. Um, strawberries, uh, lots of berries are high in vitamin C. Broccoli is actually high in vitamin C, so is kale. So there's lots of options, mangoes, papayas here. I'm thinking all these things, I'm gonna be hungry for my snack soon. Um, the second thing to add to your diet are the foods that are rich in vitamin A. Be sure to be eating lots of vitamin A rich foods. Dr. Brewer called this the anti-infection vitamin. It just helps, again, your body fight any infections that come in as the seasons change and your body's immunity changes. So things that are rich in vitamin A, um, some meats are rich in vitamin A, um, anything that's yellow or orange colored fruits and vegetables, those are rich in vitamin A. So you kind of get a two for one when you eat the citrus fruits that are orangey or like your red bell peppers, green bell peppers, uh, yellow bell peppers, all those things are rich in vitamin A and vitamin C. So getting a couple of servings of each of those every day and you'll be ready to boost your immunity for the winter. All right, so we'll see you next week for another installment of Q&A with SPB.